Ian, um, three one win, that's four friendlies, four wins. What, what what do you take from tonight's game? Just minutes. Just minutes is the players' legs. Uh, I do think we were particularly good tonight. I thought we were really disappointing on the ball. Uh, didn't move it with any temper. But it's all about pre I thought we looked a little bit lethargic. I know it was a really hot day, I, I understand that and uh, the boys have been working. Uh, but the standard, we didn't get to the standard that we've set in previous games. Uh, but I'd rather have it now than on the third of all, let's put it this way. Saying that, 3 0 up at half time, what, what, was it the second half you were perhaps a bit more disappointed with? Or? No, it was just the temper of the whole, the whole 90 minutes. I just thought we, we took too many touches on the ball. We went 3 0 up very, very quickly, and, and sometimes players can get in a, bit, a little bit of a low one. I think we did today, and we, we, uh, we tried to force things, and that we ain't been doing that. We've been moving the ball really, really well from side to side. And, and moving it with a purpose, and today it, it just seemed flat, very, very flat. So, uh, um, like I said, it's, it's, it's about minutes. We've got minutes into them, and a few of them got 90s, and they will feel that in their legs tomorrow, and that's that's what it's all about. You've got two games left, obviously, before the, the, the big game or well, first first game of the season at Guiseley. What were you going to be? What are you going to be looking for now on Saturday, and obviously against Braintree, and then um, Charlton on the Tuesday? Yeah, we'll just. Uh, same again. I mean, I think we've uh, with the min we were, we've worked the minutes out. That, uh, everyone's around the same area now, so we'll we're, we're, we'll clock up the minutes again. Who needs another ninety and and, and push them through? Uh, but we'll be looking to cement uh, the way we're going to play and a little bit of structure into it now. So uh, these next two weeks are really important, building into the third of August. I know you don't really want to give too much away with formations or how you're going to play, but do you think the next two games you're most like, more likely to start with, your, with as close to your start on 11 as possible? Well, we'll see. We'll see. Like I say, when, when I go through the minutes and, and make sure that everyone's around that area, we'll work out who, who needs a little bit more and who needs to be pushed a little bit more. But uh, now we'll be um, locking down some formation and uh, locking down some permit, uh, positions. I think you had three missing tonight. I know Ross is on holiday, yeah. uh, but the other two lads, um, Giles, and Mike. Giles and Mike, yeah, were they were they just knocks or? Yeah, no, the the work work commitments today, so they, they weren't available today. But they'll be back for the weekend. Yeah, so it wasn't a case they've got knocks and you were just resting no, them. Though. No, no, they both away with work, so it's it's just, just the way the way it's falling. You can't do anything about that. Next two games, do you think the opposition are going to perhaps give you a little bit more to think about? I think so. I think that the, the two games we've got left will be our hardest. Our, our hardest. There's no disrespect to all the others that we've played, but I think Braintree at the same level and hadn't played a league higher than us last year, uh, the league above, sorry. Uh, so that will be a good test, and we've got to go down there and, 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 and put on and be right anyway. We can't afford to play like we did tonight. Does that, will that sort of give you a marker? Because obviously you're going down there, you've obviously got to go to Guise a week later, so yes. does that sort of. You know, will that give you a marker ahead of the first game at Guiseley, do you think? I think so, there? yeah. I think so. It's, it's going to be important that we're right. Uh, and we'll, we'll work on a few things on Thursday when we're training and then um, we'll go down there in good spirits and, and try and put in uh, another one. I know it's, it's not about results. I don't care about results. It's just about the performances and looking at a little bit of combination play. Uh, I thought we was poor in the transition tonight. I didn't think we reacted quick enough. Uh, so all these little things now we need to get right. And Charlton, obviously, it's Charlton under 23s, but they're going to be fit, aren't they, full time as well? So yeah, that'll be a good test in the week. So we we just got to be careful there because it's the week leading up to the game. Uh, so we don't want to push them too much, and we'll we'll have to uh, that clever there. Does that play on your mind a little bit? Obviously, you've got a big league game four four days later, haven't you? Yes. So. Yeah, we've got to be careful with the players. We've got to protect them. So we'll uh, we'll have a discussion and see uh, what's the best way forward there. Okay, but. I know you said to Mark at the weekend you were you were just about where you wanted to be. Yeah, and that that still remains the case. It is, yeah, because we, 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 the people that needed minutes got minutes tonight. You know, there's there's a few that needed the 90 minutes, so they feel it tomorrow in their legs, and uh, uh, it's about recovery now and making sure we're ready to go on Thursday and then on Saturday. Training wise, you said you're training Thursday next week. Will you train on the Thursday, a light session before the new season as well? Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll do it. We'll, we'll, we'll knuckle down on, on our set plays and things like that. So we'll, we'll tinker with a few things and have a look. And then uh, looking forward for the big challenge.